Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. This customer's car was brought in as they said they have a water leak and every light appeared on the instrument cluster. The shop declined to work on this car due to the mold, but suspect that the water leak was from the sunroof drains being clogged. And this car was brought in for an alignment after the customer installed new tie rods. The technician took it for a test drive before the alignment and had to drive with the steering wheel upside down to drive in a straight line. Customer states his truck is all over the road. The customer just installed a bunch of new front end parts, but improperly installed them. And this car was brought in as a remote start. The customer installed himself does not work. The technician fixed the issue, but recommended to the customer to clean up this mess as his wires from the old remote start system. But the customer declined and said he would do it himself. Customer states stiff fluid got all over left rear tire and caused the tire to go flat. The technician did not find any leaks from the differential, and the customer declined the purchase of new tires. Customer states that the left rear tire is losing air. The technician found that this SUV needed four new tires and front brakes as they were almost metal to metal. The customer declined all recommendations. And this vehicle was brought in as a customer said their child got stuck in the third row seat due to the seatbelt being locked, and they had to call the fire department to cut the seatbelt. The customer also wanted it covered under warranty. You could literally just do that. Customer states driver's side fog light does not work. The technician had to explain to the customer that their vehicle was not equipped with fog lights. This SUV was brought in for an alignment after the customer said they had another shop install new parts. Whoever installed the new front and rear struts and other parts did not notice that the rear subframe was rusted through. This car was towed in as the customer said the check engine light started to flash, so he called a tow truck and did not continue to drive his car. Upon further diagnosis, the technician found that he most likely continued to drive his car, and he even installed one new spark plug which did not fix the issue. And this car was brought in as the customer says it runs sluggish, ever since he did some work on his car. The technician found that the customer got lucky, as he dropped the transmission dipstick cap when he previously had removed the intake. At the time this was filmed, this brand new vehicle had the sunroof left open overnight by a salesman, and that night they had a terrible rainstorm which filled his car with water. The technician also mentioned that the salesman wanted to sell the car exactly like this, but he had to convince him otherwise before it became a bigger issue. And this vehicle was brought in for a fuel leak. The technician found that the customer had a fuel line leaking, and tried to fix it with his welder, but it still leaks. And this trailer was brought in as the driver says the marker lights work like a signal light, and he's had to replace the fuse multiple times in a day. The mechanic found the issue and found that the driver kept adding bigger fuses until it worked. Fortunately, nobody was injured and the shop just needed a new coffee table. You can submit clips that you personally filmed on our website at justrolledinyt.com. I hope you enjoyed this video and please consider leaving a like or subscribing if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.